I want to know, are you involved in choices of colors that you, you, you wear on court? Yes, I am. Um, I'm happy that I do have a choice to, you know, to say what I like and I don't like so much. And uh, uh, honestly, the relationship with Nike is obviously fantastic. Um, they're, they're great with me, listening to my input and trying to come back with the best possible outfits and a nicest color variation. You know, this year it's a bit more red and Bordeaux red, you know, so I thought that was quite nice for, for Paris, also maybe on the, the orange clay and so forth. So you look at the court you say, hmm, this color is going to go well with that court? Or I do as well, yes, absolutely. And have I, how many t-shirts have I worn? Do I want to wear polo, maybe for Grand Slams at the French Open? I feel like polo is nicer than a t-shirt. Does it help you play better to be well dressed? I think so. Uh, I think it makes you feel better. And then obviously the materials we have and, you know, Nike can produce are very good, you know, for the body when you sweat and so forth. What about off the court? Is it important also for you to look good? Is, are you a... You, you put a lot of importance in your garde-robe? More today than 10 years ago. Back then I was having jogging shoes with jeans and uh, you know a practice shirt. So today I dress more accordingly to where I'm going and I, I started obviously also taking uh, joy in putting on suits. How many suits do you own? Do you own a lot of suits? What do you think? How many? Um, 60? Oh, not that many. Maybe 25 or 35. I'm not sure. <laughs> so for Andre Agassi, image was everything. For you, it's not everything, but it is something. It's a lot, yes, of course. I think it's important, you know, uh, uh, to offer something different to the fans. And, and at the end, it's important that you, you enjoy it. And I do, and that's, that's most important.